And on the left side of the station we have Mr. Officer Keaton. <laughs> Keaton. Cool map. I've come from Captain Ridiger. Do you need a pilot here? Right you are. And what's your name, son? My name's Treese. Treese Crichton. It's quite dangerous in our system now, Treese. The transports are often attacked by raiders, and not only them. To fly in planetary space is similar to walking in a minefield, but not the same safety. Of course, that disturbs Elder Elnil, and that's why you're here. here. Uh, put a stop to this. I won't lay you down, no doubt about it. You will get your chance to prove it, pilot. Raiders' squads attack our caravans constantly in space. Hmm. <laughs> what are you going to do about the raiders? I want to take part. My ship has been repaired in the meantime. Perfect. We're raising a convoy escort. If you want to dis if you want to join, you should talk to the wing commander. That we shall do. And last of all, to show you around, we shall visit the bar. It has a very long corridor for some reason. Well, it's not very long, but it's long by this game's standards. With three holograms, and it will only ever contain three holograms. But there uh, can be some interesting goings on in here occasionally, in the right places. So, bartender, what's new? Interesting. Is it possible at all? What possible? Ah, uh, what? Oh, excuse me, I was thinking about. What do you wish, sir? Wait a minute, I'm interested to know. What is it you're talking about? Nothing serious, really. Tell me, what would you like? Is it young beer, or...? <laughs> Don't chop my teeth. I won't order a drink till you explain me what happened. Alright, if you're so interested. I've got a feeling that I'm somebody's clone, or vice versa. I may be an original, but there are my clones. Um, now I see, and what does your psychiatrist think about it? Oh, that's what I told you. You're laughing at me now. Hey, notice that cola right behind his head? <gasps> And why shall I not? Where did you get these thoughts? Have you met your clone? I never did, because I never even left this station. But people tell me that they have seen exactly the same bartenders as me at the other stations. And I even have some visions and feeling, like I, I look at something with unfamiliar eyes, and I don't know if it's possible at all. Well, uh, if, if you're looking through your clone's eyes, wouldn't they be familiar in some way, you know? I don't know, maybe it's possible. Well, you'd better give me a drink. It's hard to process this amount of new information while being sober. No, oh, that's an idea. What would you like? Vodka? Beer? Wine? Whiskey? Maybe something more potent, like absinthe, for example? Yes, they have everything here. But I... Uh, no thanks. As you wish. Come back. Should you change your mind, I'll be glad to serve you. And here we have the space tourist, who is of no use to us, and the Klats. 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 They are weird things with feathers. They're bird-like, but not... Like, this one looks completely different from that one. I mean, he even sits differently. Like, no one's standing, no one's sitting, but... Uh, yeah. Clats are a strange people, they are, oh yes. Uh, the only other place we can go is in here. Where there is, well, nothing. 
Nothing at all! But the stars. And a food dispenser. <laughs> ah, and a cleaning bot. I sure hope there aren't cameras in there. Um, a transport pilot, eh? Oh, we won't talk to you at the moment. But hey, check this guy out. He is called Netek Apiron. I have no idea who or what this guy is, or if Netek Aperon is actually a title, because this guy in all the space stations will appear in exactly the same place with, with exactly the same name. So, and you never get to talk to him. So I have no idea about him. Also, take a good hard look at this guy, this bartender. Okay, he looks like just like everybody else we've met. And just keep that in mind, yeah? <laughs> no wonder why he's having visions of clones. All this uh, drink and I can't pick up any of it. Huh. Uh, this one's for uh, aliens with four arms and antennas and flat heads. Now, strangely, we can't go in this uh, room either. Anyway, we should get back out of space so that we can escort a transport. <laughs> la 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 la. Also, notice the map there. Very nice. It's all nicely detailed, you know. Ah. <laughs> okay, let's get back. Back out and back into action. Uh, the pirates are the weakest enemies in space. The raiders, rather. Oh yes, let's accelerate. Let's save. And let's go hyper! Uh, 15, 14 GM away. Well, what's a GM? I've never heard of that unit of measurement before. It's like... Nah. I, I have no idea. Nope. Whoa! The ah, rock! Again! They're doing it again! Remember, mining is a lucrative business. You just have to mine a lot. And that blue thing over there, that's an anomaly, not a nebula. An anomaly. It will do stuff to you. Go normal speed! Welcome, Captain. We are waiting for you to continue on our way to Golden. <laughs> to escort a ship, point the crosshairs at it and select Enter Formation from the menu. The autopilot will turn on straight away. To switch controls back to normal, press C or F and select manual control from the menu. Okay. Let us join the escort. Thankfully. <laughs> uh, escorting this ship is much as much easier than escorting that science ship in free space. Oh boy, look at all those lasers! Uh, Force to disconnect. Yep, follow our instructions carefully. So as I was saying, raiders, the weakest enemy in space. Uh, we will just wait till you see what <laughs> what we'll end up fighting. Oh, ah. Blaster overheating. Uh, I'd like to destroy these guys quickly. Hey, come on, that shouldn't be overheating. I was able to fire much more than that yeah, the first time I played. Oop. <laughs> okay. 
All escort ships return to the formation as soon as possible before all the pirates in the sector pay us a visit. Okay. Also, doesn't the look of this transport remind you of the transports from Free Space? What are they called again? Those uh, Lambda transports. Yes, Lambda class. So. <laughs> Those planets go by awfully fast. And those planets, they don't spin. <laughs> Thanks for the help. If I were, n if it, it were not for you, we would be lost in space. I will report about your heroic deed and you will get your well-deserved reward. Good luck, my young friend. Very good. 